Good evening. Clint liquor. <laughs> Welcome. Pineapple. Actually, that reminds me. I need to add that game to my wish list. Hey, that pineapple pizza game that you guys are talking about. Pineapple. Did you mean pineapple? Yes. Oh, shoot. This game's free? Alright. <laughs> yeah, I'll, I'll look at it. Kind of just yucking it up, though. Yeah, alright. We might do that for a stream. It's similar to The Witness and Jazz Punk. I can't think of two games that are more... <laughs> More diametrically opposed. The Witness <laughs> and Jazz Punk. Wait, what the fuck? This guy's like... It didn't take too long, but after a while, I 100% completed the game. Pretty cool. 115 hours on record. Edit, my wife tick, look, yeah, blah, 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 blah. No, that was not a helpful review. Fuck you. I'm bitchy tonight. We're, we're downvoting shit reviews. Fuck off. Fuck off. Oh, I hate them so much. I hate them. Man, I can't believe I've played like 30 hours of EU4 over the last two weeks. That's so fucked up. I have a problem. I have a problem. I had an early one last night, fellas, so... That's why I wasn't here, sorry. But I hope you get, hopefully you're doing alright. Hopefully you're taking, taking care of yourself. And uh, we're ready to engage in a whole new chapter of this spooky game. We sort of, actually, sort of, we really fumbled around uh, in this last zone. But we'll see how we go uh, in the next little bit. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty excited. I've got a little bit of a... <laughs> Watch your VOD from YouTube a few days ago. Oh, hell yeah. We got VOD boys in here. Let's go. Mr. Swordfish. Hello. I remember. Oh, man. Remember? Okay. Hello? Alright, there we go. Sorry guys, I, my fucking entire microphone arm, like my microphone stand arm thing, the entire thing, like dismounted, fucking fell on the table, knocked over my cup and spilled like a liter of fucking water everywhere, including on top of my fucking computer. <sighs> so, excuse me while I just mop the fucking floor for a little bit. As the start at the start of the stream. Hell yeah, what a fucking awesome start. Oh, I'm livid. I'm fucking furious.
So that's that's where I fucking dis it just keeps happening. Dude, genuinely, you know those big like boom mic arms? The the entire thing, the entire thing just crashed down. Like, what did I do? What did I do to deserve this? Have I not paid for my fucking sins? Ugh. Luckily my PC has this little like, ah, fuck. God damn it. I knelt on something sharp. Well, hey, enjoy the fucking streamer gets killed on camera experience that we're doing tonight. Fuck me. Shit's dripping off the table. Ugh. This is just... Fuck, this sucks. Yo, I'm not cancelling the stream tonight. We're gonna play the fucking game. But I'm not happy. Dude, I was like... Trying to channel so much positive energy. Oh, but now everything's all wet. I hate this. I gotta clean it up. Because of all, like, there are so many electronics around here, dude. This is ridiculous. We got all these cables, the whole fucking computer. So we should be all right. We should be all right. stuff's in this, these like wide bottom glasses, They're like the really wide bottom ones. Don't worry bro, it's so bottom heavy, it's so bottom heavy, there's no way it'll tilt over. It's, far, it's impossible for it to spill bro, it's fucking so sturdy. <laughs> Fuck off! Most nothing shit ever. All right, okay. So I'm gonna do this and move this here, move that here. Um, what else am I gonna do? I need to plug this back in. All right, if the stream ends, it's because my house exploded and I died. Steady, steady. Oh, okay, we're back, we're back. We got lights. Oh. <sighs> Drink, Jesus Christ. The whole goddamn arm just came off. It's fucking crazy. Alright, we're here! Um, I'm here to game, alright? I'm just here to fucking game tonight. Alright, now I need to adjust my headphones because they're fucky. Probably because they're all wet. <laughs> 
There we go. That's better. All right. How are you guys? Are you guys okay? GG. <laughs> have you guys recovered? I swear to God, that would have like anyone. <laughs> I feel like everyone, uh, uh, you know, who's watching the stream just took, like, psychic damage. The AoE from that event was just... It was too much. Alright. Luckily, I guess the mouse pad absorbed a lot of liquid, so there's, there's that. Far out. Okay, hey, let, let's play the computer game. Let's just, uh... Let's just try and relax with this incredibly fucking creepy game. <sighs> oh boy! Oops, nope, we don't need that. We need the other one. <sighs> Everyone, just deep breath in. Another little bit. Now breathe out. <sighs> ah, okay, we're ready. My towel rail fell off today. Weird coincidence. Yeah, that was the chain reaction that's, that caused the whole mess. I reckon something happened in um, uh, Mongolia. Something happened in Mongolia today in some dude's house that caused someone in uh, South Korea to have like something fucked up happen to them. And because of that, it impacted someone in uh, Uzbekistan. I don't know. <laughs> and it all made its way all the way here today to me. Oh, it's a little imp. There's a small imp from RuneScape. That's scuttling around. <gasps> okay. <laughs> so we're in a new chapter of the game. Um, and I haven't looked anything up about this. Hello? Hello? I'm here. I have AIDS. My name is Sheg. There we go. Let's play the computer. Remember, this is a, a cheeky game that is very scary. Play AOS? Uh, I, I have a lot of AOS. <laughs> I've, played a, I've played a few games. I wouldn't say that I'm a, a gamer. But yeah, I play AOS. Got some Stormcasts. Got some... Fucking, um, grots and got some skeletons. Yeah, cool as fuck. I want to, I want to do some rats. I want to get some rats. I reckon, I reckon we'll see some new rats next year, which will be cool. I, I, I'm just working on my little, like, warband for Mordheim. But using all the AOS orcs, because they're cool. Play 40k? Yeah, I need to get back to my 40k. I haven't touched in ages. So here we are! Here we are, here we are. So we've... Okay, basically, we've made it through the... Um, this is the tunnel to the outside realm. Now, is, is the game loud enough? It should be fine. Alright, there we go. Minimize. Hello. Hello. The tunnel walls were crushed by some enormous roots. I can dig. I don't know. Oh. I can dig through the rubble. Interesting. A light bulb dimly lit lits. <laughs> a light bulb dimly lits the wet walls of the underground passage. The further part is shrouded in complete darkness. I need a light source to continue. Motorcycle magazine. It's from this year's issue, so it's 1987 currently. Are those helium balloons? Battery. Alright. The thick wooden posts barely hold the soaked ground and the tangled roots. The construction seems on the verge of collapse. What the fuck was that? Is that a ghoul? Is that a poop rat? There's a fucking golem in here. There's an empty corpse. 
A fucking Smeagol is gonna jump out and go, ah! Well, I accidentally stepped on the poisonous mushrooms and, well, let me tell you, well. How loud is that droning? Okay, so I think it's a little too loud. Let's turn that down. There you go. The walls reverberate with my every footstep. The doctor's here. Are we going? I will definitely harvest some fucking mushies. What do I want to get rid of? I, I don't want to get rid of anything. Yeah, we, we're keeping it all. Ooh, holy shit. It's locked. It's my only way out. I won't be able to open it without my key. Look at the handle. The latch handle is covered in a thick layer of dust. It hasn't been opened for at least two weeks. Look through the keyhole. <laughs> oh, fuck this. Press your ear against the keyhole. I can hear a faint voice throughout the howling wind. It sounds familiar. It seems to be coming through the keyhole. Someone's calling me. Ask the doctor to use the key. Hello? I'm running, fuck this. This guy's got heavy footsteps. The golem's gonna fucking come and scuttle and get us, isn't it? Get back here! I think there's some- someone's moving there under the rubble. Hello? The man. Whoa! Hello? What the fuck? What am I seeing? I stumble upon something amongst the rubble. I can't make out what it is. Hello? I'm trying to find where- where's the man? There he is! He's like growing in, in the- in the roots. A strange soft item, the weird cross. The tunnel has collapsed recently. The reinforced steel protruding from the debris has not been covered with rust yet. When I gaze into the tunnel, I notice a silhouette of a man on the ground. The man. Suddenly the man snaps to life, as if woken up from a deep slumber. Who goes there? I hear faint, unnaturally distorted male voice. Are you one of them? The man attempts to get up but fails. I can see him desperately flailing his limbs around. It's as if his back's been glued to the ground. No, please! As I approach him, he shuffles his leg nervously, as if trying to retreat into the collapsed tunnel. I didn't do anything, I beg you, I just wanted to pass to get back to my family. The tree has blocked the only way out. The only path, I'm a huge talking tree. I begged it to let me pass, but it wouldn't listen. I could not understand what it was saying to me, so we came here. The man props himself up on his elbows. With huge effort, he tries to straighten his body, but something is firmly holding him by the back and by the neck. I can't. I can't get up. The man drops onto the rubble and goes silent. He clenches in fists. My head hurts. The man places his hands on his forehead and feels a strange dent above his left brow. He freezes. W what is this? He carefully inserts his index finger into the hole. His eyelid twitches. My stone. The charm of different playthroughs with this game. Complete different cutscenes with the way the, <laughs> the man narrates them. Oh man, I forget what fucking characters sound like. I, I can't be held accountable. I hear a sound, as if an egg, uh, as if an eggshell cracking. The forehead bends under his hand. The stranger pushes another finger into the hole. A thick goo spews from the wound. I can hear his skull cracking. My little stone. The man slowly removes his fingers from the hole in his head. A colorless ooze dripping from them. He's holding something. A round object. That's why. He swings his left hand and throws the object at me. A small, irregular ball bounces off my arm and lands at my feet. It looks like a bullet, but it's soft. What the fuck? One instance, this man is weak and wispy. Another, it's just some bloke from the pub in Liverpool. He's charging up. The roots are taking over. This is what put me to sleep. His head lifelessly drops to the concrete floor of the destroyed tunnel and goes still. 
Suddenly I can hear the bang of the metal door, followed by the sound of fading footsteps. It's the doctor. The doctor has fled. Get back here, motherfucker! A big sign on the door reads, Closed Area. Something is in the fucking sludge! Oh! Ooh. I just wanted to pass to PS. Return to my family. I L Y. What if he said I L Y? JK. Hello. This tunnel's fucking shit. Why can't we just go live in that village? Everything there was kind of chill, to be honest. Oh, what is that? I just wanted to pass. It's like a crocodile man. gonna jump out and get me. Okay, no. What the, is that a Omega Worm? Whoa, there's a oh, 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 Look at those eye bulbs. What is that? Growths. Some strange organic growths. You don't fucking say. Ah! Oh god, that scared me. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Fuck you. A soft organism growing out of the ground. Those eyes got spooked. Yeah. Remember, they're more afraid of you than you are of it. Shiny stone. Whoa! Yeah, this shit goes hard. Feel free to screenshot. Shiny man. A dried body of some man. Only skin and bones covered in roots. They're surprisingly well preserved. There's a small hole in his forehead. I'd say it's been lying here for more than two years. Are we out? <laughs> Where are we now? Where the fuck are we? I think in the guide that I was looking at. Nothing in here, I guess. Better move on. Oh, I mean, <sighs> I kind of want to go back, but I, I'm i running out of light and lamps. I actually, you know what? No, we should go back because we're probably missing something that we need for story progression, hey? Gotta be diligent. Gotta be safe. Gotta be careful. Oh, chapter two. Oh, well, wait, no, ain't no going back. Where the fuck am I? Test Swamp Resorts. Location found. Hideout. What the fuck? A crate covered in a strange organic black shell. I won't be able to open it until I get rid of this substance. This is like the, the worms from, um... Uh... What's that movie? Princess no no, not Princess Nausicaa. Uh, it's another Ghibli film. It's got the big hog in it covered in the worms. The deep worms. What does this say? Uh, it's in a different language. I can't read it anyway. 84, 172. Oh, eye bulbs. There's more bulbs over there. Little looking bulbs. Alright, get ready to do a big whack attack. There might be someone in here. Who was that? Is that me? 
Hello? Night protection. Let's repair the well. Alright, the well is repaired. Why does that glow? What's up with that? It's so creepy. Alright, let me cook. Let me cook. Alright, the oven is on. That is our bonfire. It's covered in a thick layer of dust. It looks like no one's used it in a long time, but it still smells of warm plastic and burnt wires. This is a pretty safe little area, unless bullshit comes out of this. A skull tone. Flare. Knife. Note. Day one. 1315 hours. The compressor is broken. So is the thick lock on the trap. Oh, sorry, the map is outdated. It must have been prepared around two years ago. The woods have changed considerably since then. Moreover, it's so ragged it's barely readable. However, I think I can make out the position of the cottage near the junkyard and the village with that tree. We've got a lot of journal entries. Uh, the compressor is broken. So is the lock on the trap door leading to the underground. Had to use a blowtorch. Fucking moisture. Day two, 1200 hours. We took... 45 photos of the tree from the observation point in the vicinity of 3C. It grew twice the size in a month. Really quick, even for the local standards. Day 2, 15, 20 hours. I'm slowly running out of oxygen. I sent two men to search. The, uh, search the nearby junkyard. Maybe we won't have to go back for spare parts for the compressor. Watch out for the cottage near the junkyard, marked building on the map. Someone could be living there. Day 2, 18, 12 hours. At least 10 locals lurking between the trees. How do they know about us? We won't be able to gather our equipment in time. The risk of getting detected is too high. I need to evac. Stay away from that. Stay away from that trap door. <laughs> Hitting the tank will release the gas under high pressure. So what do we got in here? Is this going to be a separate building that will have our... Workbench. Need a key. I don't have a key. Oh, I really would love to fucking <laughs> dump my inventory in it. Here we go. Here's the workbench. All right. We now have a have a have a little place. A little zone to work in, boys. Oh, we don't have much fuel. Oh man. This is so <laughs> this is really cool. The village. The hideout. The cottage near the junkyard. We have lots of places to to, to, to to check out. I'm worried that we're just going to be encountering, like, red things as, like, our default enemy now. A damaged compressor used to refill oxygen tanks. I should be able to fix it. Why do we need oxygen tanks? Maybe, maybe we need to, like, scuba our way out. Exploding barrel. <laughs> cool. Alright, let's head up to the village that the guy was talking about in his notes. There's a bear trap. Jesus Christ. I heard something. What was that? Giant drum of boom. Just shove that in my pocket. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll put that in my inventory. I think I'll take that one for later. Just another big, big dog. Out here in the swamps, out here in the bayou, brother. Oh, big building. I was like, what is this wall of darkness? Alright, can't go in that way. Let's find a way in. 
Ooh, this sucks. We're in the fucking mangroves. Hello? Oh man, that's the mud. The mud and the grab. There's something nearby. There's a dog nearby. But there is a chest to inspect. Oh! Bro, I'm sorry. I'm so- Whoa, what the fuck is that? I think that's the guy that explodes. Jesus. The mold man cometh. What is that sound? It's not a swamp, it's a sewer. Which is a swamp at Intos. Stop making that fucking noise. What is that? Dead mushroom man. Also has meat. He just emerged from the fucking undergrowth. Right, what do we got in here? Pipe gasoline fabric. Metal pipe. Post the metal pipe meme sound effect. Alright, I'm wondering if there's like a tell. There is some kind of like way of knowing where those things will uh, emerge from, those mushroom men. You got bugs. An egg. Something's floating inside. Maybe I could puncture it or pierce it with something. Give me the embryo. I don't know what for, but I'm taking it. Because I don't want it to hatch and come and get me. Ooh. Got a wagon. A little broken down wagon. With nothing in it. Okay, sucks. A building. Which kind of just leads nowhere. I guess it technically leads over here, but okay, whatever. Sure. Ooh, okay, we're getting a little bit lost. We need to find another landmark. There's a body over here. Is this a trap? Pills, alcohol, pills, pills. Hell yeah. Let's mix them all together and see what happens. Poisonous mushrooms everywhere. Is this water? Yes. There's a cultist. There's a guy with a... Whoa. We got like three, t four torsos over here. And they look to be like fused. Alright, I'm just gonna leave that guy. You, can, you do you, brother. Oh, <laughs> the crow. Bear trap, pills, wire, wire. I'm going to make a lockpick. Because you'll likely need one of those. Getting some good loot. Getting some good loot. Ugh, there's that growth that does damage to us when we step on it. I thought they were corpses, but I guess not. I guess it's just weird poisonous root. Roots. Unlabeled pills you'll find on the ground will cure what ails you. Exactly. <laughs> That's a big dog. Or maybe it's a horse. Whatever it is, it's... It's not it anymore. Alright, we're back at the base. Let's look over here a little bit. A 
God, he's this alluring red mist. This man's priorities is more like, can I put it in my veins first? No, nom. <laughs> yeah, we gotta melt shit down and put it in my, our veins. We gotta inject that shit into my eyeball. The sirens call. Ooh, what was that? Pain. What is in? What is it? Can I look at it from back here? What the fuck? Can I throw an exploding barrel at it? I want to blow up the pain. <laughs> it's a good question. Anyway. Alright, ready? We've got the well. We can always go to the well. What can I throw to make it blow up? What can I do to make that thing blow up? Alright, whatever. I'm out of here. I'm out of here. I'm out of here. We need to go drink from the well. Fuck that. Jesus Christ. Ugh. That thing's so weird. Alright, what's up the top? You got some... Some roots. Some sticks. Sort of par for the course out here. What is that? Oh, mushrooms. That's a fucking trap, dude. I'm gonna go to this <laughs> less obvious trap. My inventory's full. My inventory is full. He weird squelching. Uh, which one's? Ah! Okay, 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 okay. That's what that does. I see. I see. Take the meat to the kitchen. Meat to the kitchen. God damn, this is scary. <laughs> this is really scary. You need to gloss over the VODs, see what the sights you've seen. The fact that you're in the swamp with the board and nails is certainly something. I don't know what to do. <laughs> um, actually, my board and nails is currently maxed out. I'll have you know. Border nails is just old reliable. I right, see. It's because I keep accidentally throwing the knife. Alright, there we go. As long as this gets the job done exactly. Ooh, a sickle. Yeah, but it doesn't interrupt enemy attacks. I don't like that. I want it to interrupt enemy attacks. Alright, um, I want to take my fuel. Where's the Jenny? Where's the generator? Oh, I can't lockpick that. That's a metal door, so I won't be able to knock it down, I don't think. No, the, comp the compressor is missing parts, isn't it? Stop! <laughs> With your Eldritch bullshit. Gotta practice my stabbing. <laughs> Meepers very good at video games. <laughs> All right, let's go. Let's go this way. Check some things out. See what we can see. Give me 
out of the water. Little islands everywhere. Okay, I'm not taking damage in the water at least, you know? That could have been something. Who's out here? Dog. I'm using the board and nail on the dog, dude. I, I, I know the pattern. I know the pattern for that weapon. What have we got over here? Little shortcut. What the fuck? A fallen tree. Its bark looks particularly chewed up. Okay, it's getting a bit dark. I think the sun is now setting. We should think about leaving soon. Oh, that scared me. It made me jump. Come on, that's got to be a friendly mushroom sound. What is that sound? Shiny stone. Ooh, is that... I love... Escape. Is that one fucking tree on the way from uh, Lumbridge to Varrock? And it reaches out at you. That's a trap. Is that hole? A little hole in the ground. The dog buried its meat there. Okay. I'm gonna need to put in a couple of logs. My nails, where's my nails? My nails. Uh, where are my nails there? Barricade me in. Jesus Christ. Okay. That's just pain. It's the Gom Jabbar. I've made a bear trap. Inshallah, I will not step on it. Now, we lame it out, boys. We just lame it out. You guys got any good stories? Anything cool happening in your neck of the woods? Ugh. Let me wipe this. There we go. Okay, okay. We've got some electrical failings. A manifestation. Guys, I don't think. Oh, it's the radio. The radio's fucking around. You're listening to Fat Bitch FM. Cumbus. <laughs> Cumbus. Come attack. Come back to us. Yeah, I'm trying to. I'm trying to leave the fucking... Oh, unless it's telling me to go deeper into the woods. Stand back. Gotta practice my stamina. What is...
is that? Something bright and glowy over there. It's a government agent. I'm not fucking checking it out. Fuck that. Fuck that. All roads lead deeper into the woods. No. No. Oh, that's the, the, the mulch. The mulch chest. You know, maybe we should go check out the mulch chest. Maybe it... Maybe it's not all mulchy at night time. Oh, we have a generator. Nope. What's happening? What's going on? Fence. Interesting. Rusty oxygen tanks, they're useless. Fuck, I should have stuck with the, the rusty nail, dude. I should have stuck with the rusty nail. That's what I'm telling you. All right, let's fill up the, uh... Nope. Who are these guys? These guys look fucking awesome. The three. Yo! These guys look so cool. I love them. Yeah, I'm the third one. I'm the second one. And I'm the first one. The three visitors stare at me in silence, as if waiting for my move. I can only hear the heavy breathing of the tallest figure holding a giant bag. As the tallest figure opens the bag, the room is filled with an intense smell of mushrooms. Yo. Hey, yo, chat, which one are you? Are you number one, number two, or number three? Which one's your favorite? Apparently, they wish to give me something. Show item. Trade. Red egg. What do we want? Would you like, um, a shiny stone? What should we buy? I reckon we should probably try and save up and get an axe, you know? Alright, let's just give that to them. I like that we build up reputation. I do like that as a, as a system. What can we sell? Antidote. Maybe they want the embryo. Let's give them the embryo. I guess I'll, I'll sell the torch because it's almost run out. Don't have enough. I still can't afford it. Still can't afford it. Maybe we just bank it for now. Damn, this guy survived the night. Respect. Or look at this guy who got punked. I ain't selling him shit. Yeah, we need to survive to get more reputation. Let's just bank it for now. Let's bank it. Um, what do we need to do? I'm gonna fill up the generator over here a little bit. Get it to about half. I ah, fill it up. Yeah, we'll just empty the tank. Fuck it. No, no reason not to. Oh. Uh, let's cook. I've got a mushroom to cook. Which 
chuck that in there. Let's block this area off. Be all cheeky. And we've got to figure out what today's plan is. You know? I guess we just... I want to go to the village. We've got to go to the village. we got to check out that village. Ooh, we can... Yo! A note with a photo of signs. 12th of September, 1984. We found new sign. 17 kilometers west of the hideout. 33 points. 12 circles. A catalog pattern. Alpha 34... Uh, well, A... 34H, six unidentified patterns. Simple scribblings of a madman. What did he mean by this? Hello. <laughs> I like these guys. Do you guys want a shotgun shell? Oh, I can't sell them anything more. Their inventory is full. You want one of these? <laughs> no. Alright, we can try and set one of those up as like a fucking... Uh, a, a cool trap. Let's make a torch. A fresh torch. Uh, and I guess that's it. Put those pills in there. All right, let's prepare for the day. Let's prepare for the day. I don't want any single-use guns, though. Well, all right, we're headed to the village. North to the village. Let us travel onwards, dear Chet. See what we find in these damnable woods. Ooh. Wait, that's that building that we saw before. Dogbert, stand down. Stand down. Ooh, here we go. This is the way. Oh, lordy! Woo! Oh my god, it's first! Another one! Fuck off! Jesus Christ. Human spider. <sighs> Jesus. That was fucked up. That was very fucked up. <laughs> oh, good lord. Are you seriously growling at me, dog? Ain't no way. Ain't no way. Oh, I almost stepped on that fucking poisonous mushroom. Okay. The rot has overtaken this. Crows. Something must have scared them off from the huge tree crown towering over the village. And it weren't me. What is that? Something slimy is happening. 
Hello. Hello. Villager. Figures of the shrine bear signs of teeth. It's partially eaten. Yuck. Hello. It's the doctor! Hey! You motherfucker! You again. What do you want from me? Want to put me in front of the firing squad for desertion? The doctor snorts ironically, <coughs> hiding his irritation. I'm not going anywhere with you. I'm too close. I can hear her. Just as if she was standing beside me, my little... With shaking hands, he reaches for the cigarette butt between his yellow teeth. I'm sure someone's waiting for you, too. He spits out the rest of the tobacco. Show item. No. Trade. Gossip. I realized something came to me when we were walking through the tunnels. You're like a disease. Mr. Anderson. You're like a disease. You and your kind. The doctor takes a step back as if he was afraid of me. At the same time, a sinister smile appears on his face. You don't belong to this land. You weren't here when the forest was born. You're a splinter, a foreign body, a vagabond. And them, the forest and everything else here, these are the entities bodies <laughs> even the morons from the village raging white blood cells in an infected Sorry, I. <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. Sorry, I was doing. I, I did a. I did a Spock voice for the. Uh, for when he said logical, very logical, Captain. I used to come here to treat people. I pulled out kids' milk, milk teeth, delivered babies, and then came the diseases I've never even heard of. I was the only doctor in the area. You cut us off from the outside world. <laughs> in an infect. <laughs> Looking to get sucked. First you, then the woods. No help from anyone. Last night I came here it was three or four years ago. Then the trees blocked the path. The doctor looks around the area. Hang on, I'm fucking with the microphone again. There we go. It's different now. The fields are flooded. Everyone in the village is dead. So much work for nothing. The peasants broke through the wall of trees. I could not believe my eyes. I tried to do it many times. I couldn't manage to cut the trees fast enough. It was as if the woods were healing the scars. The motherfuckers were growing back right in front of my eyes. I was afraid to get stuck between the trunks. Losing that cell made their blood run cold. They escaped fearing starvation. The doctor smiles as he puffs a cigarette. Out of the frying pan and into the fire. They have a camp in the old quarry in the southwestern edge of the swamp. That's cool to know. Ah! You little shit. Ruins of an old cottage have been marked on the map. It contains a caption. Holes! Worth checking out. Location. Holes. Location. Shia LaBeouf in the hit film. Holes. Yeah, yeah, we did the wolf. We, I, I, I fucking did what the wolf told me to do. And uh, fucked it up. And now I'm really, like, <laughs> rethinking listening to that character. Gonna paint your wagon, gonna paint it good. Ooh. Another base. Maybe. We'll see. It's a fucking dwarf. Oh no, that's a there's this big long leg here. Big well there. Skeleton pills. Mmm. Something's here. Something's here. Ah, 
I didn't bring my lockpick with me. Oh. There's an ogre. There's a fucking ogre nearby, dude. It's so close. Fuck off. Hey. Hey, if you're nearby, don't fucking come here. I'll kick your ass. A sickle. Oh, it's a red thing. I can see the huge... I can see the crown of a huge tree through the, through the small window under the ceiling. Lottery ticket. Did we win? <gasps> humana, 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 humana. Punked. <laughs> we fucking punked Toto with that meme, though. <laughs> nah, the wolf is totally trustworthy. You did the morally correct thing. An ogre-friendly way. It's a fucking red thing, isn't it? Probably one of those fucking yellow things you've been seeing. Oh, maybe it's the the pain bringer. Hello? Who are you? Whoa, he's a gnome. Wait, bloody hell, you're alive. The old man extends his hand, blindly trying to reach me. You're not from around here, eh? You cannot be. Mm. All them lads are dead. It's only me and... He finally finds my arm and grabs it. For a moment, he clutches my hand in silence. Then I hear him mumbling under his breath. Oh, Don't have anything, mate. Only this... This chair, bloody hell. His gaze stops somewhere under the leaky barn ceiling. What? The old man suddenly jumps up. What are you saying? I feel his long fingernails digging into my hand. Ain't no fucking tree, that. Looks like a tree, but those faces... I know him, buggers. Every single one of them, so close and so fake. They're not real, they're not. From time to time, I thank God I went blind. I don't have to look at them. The old man lets go of my hand to lean against the broken back of the chair. He sighs with a relief. It disgusts me. <laughs> it fucking disgusts me. It's nothing. <laughs> All this buggery, this fucking scum. All the time I have to listen to this pathetic blabber. Complaining all the time, as if I was supposed to believe it's human. <laughs> and it's me, soccer. Yeah, right. He suddenly reaches towards me with, with both hands. Almost falling out from the chair, he grabs onto my sleeve. I feel all his weight on me. You lad, you've got your hands and legs. Strong arms, I beg you. Get rid of that filth from my village. Can't bear another day of that abomination wailing and sobbing. I want to die in peace, fucking hell. I want to die in peace. Listen to me. I thought about it for a long time. I've had a lot of time to think for fuck's sake. His eyes widen. His pupils are milky white. I can feel him climbing my coat. You need to find the basement. Just the basement. I remember it. It's right next to the tree. Isn't Jassy the chicken brother? The tree's too large, so even if you can't reach it from the top, you gotta try from the bottom. Find the basement. And there, surely you'll find the tree's roots. The bloody thing must have roots, that's where they are. Destroy them, pull them, drag them, twist the fuck out of them, you'll find a way, eh? You know you will. The old man slides down my coat, straight into his destroyed wheelchair. For a moment, he searches for a stone, which he used to prop himself up against the muddy floor of the barn. Thank you, thank you. What a fucking weirdo. Alright, I'm filling up my cup. Holy! Holy! like an hour remind me to preheat the oven Ugh. 
I show him an item. Photo of a road. The old man grabs the... <laughs> Why am I showing him anything? He's blind! <laughs> the old man grabs the photograph, feels it, then takes out a small glass object from his pocket and puts it to his eye. The road. The road home. What a load of bollocks. Road to madness is what it is. Okay, so he's not fully blind. You come across some wheels. Two little wheels that I could fix me chair. Maybe you would benefit from it as well. Used to be different here. First, the woods changed. Trees started sprouting up everywhere. We were cut off. And the water flooded our fields. People went crazy out of hunger. They fought over food. No one lives around here anymore. Everyone's dead. Don't they sometimes? And the man lowers his voice. Sometimes I hear footsteps. They wake me up at night. The sound of bare feet against the floor. And bells, sort of. They come out of nowhere. They move towards the trees and come back. They pass me in full silence. They're like a nightmare. Bloody nightmare. Alright, one more gossip, then we, then we move on. What are you going on you know, What are you going on about then? The old man leans forward towards me, scowling. The wheelchair? The war took me legs. Then those wankers burned me out at me pigs. But it was years after the war. They said it was to fight the disease. So they said, and me, and me Zocca, the disease took her from me. All I have is this wheelchair and this land. Right, we're up. See you later, old man. I'm... Fish. Got a fishy. Fuck. I accidentally stepped on the mushroom. So let's see if we can see what he's talking about. Hello? Basement hatch. The hatch leading to the basement is blocked from the inside. The marks on it suggest someone's tried to break it open. And of course I'm not allowed to enter. forwards. Oh! I stepped on another fucking mushroom. The talking tree. Whoa! 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 That's cool as fuck. Look at that. That's so cool. The tree's gigantic. Its bark stays in constant motion. It swells up and collapses onto itself, as if breathing. I see human silhouettes growing out of the tree trunk. They're also moving, as if gesturing in slow motion. Dozens of mouths repeat their lines simultaneously, creating a uniform, noisy murmur. Between the boughs, I catch a man's gaze. It's fixed on me. His body, similarly to the other being, seems to form an integral part of the tree. His limbs are gnarled, and his face is grotesquely deformed. He's the only one to acknowledge my presence. His hand slowly raises, pointing to something on the horizon, above the roofs of the destroyed village. The man's lips are moving, but the ghastly murmur of the other voices drowns out his words. Kick the tree, hoping the voices will go silent. Try to climb the tree. Look at the lips of the person talking to me, or leave. Well, I'm looking at some lips. I'm going to look at this guy's lips. Even though the figure speaks sluggishly, it's too high for me to read its lips properly. I think one of the words is radio. Uh, I don't want to... Hang on. Let me save the game. Oh no, it constantly saves. Okay, no, I'm not kicking shit. Inventory full? Inventory's full, we gotta go back. We're going back. We gotta go back to the base. I really wanna just kick the tree though. 
Not gonna lie. There's a fucking red thing around here, dude. I'm out, I'm out, I'm out. I'm moving, I'm moving, I'm grooving. Have you looked in here yet? Oh! It's it's like an accursed red thing. It's like a leveled up one. It's got the it's got the Miyazaki sludge on it. On what wrath you may procure Oh, I obey the no spoilers request. On what wrath you may procure from kicking a giant tree made of men? I stepped on a fucking thing because I was looking at the chat. Well, thank you for no spoilers. Thank you. Okay, look, it's not too far away. It's not that far. Look at these fucking spiders that I fucked up. I'm powerful. I'm gaming out here. Hey, Ma, I'm gaming in here. What if he did kick it? Don't text and stumble? <laughs> Think of the content. Fucking hell. Alright, we got some stuff to cook. Oh, we almost got a full syringe! We almost have a full syringe! Alright, let's upgrade, uh, like a, a, a sickle. I guess. Okay, we can't. <laughs> we cannot upgrade anything. Okay, uh, I'll take a pill for healing. And that's kind of it. That's kind of it. I don't think I need to take anything else. Alright, we've done a cool bit of exploring over there. Let's, uh, let's punch south a little bit more. Just so that uh, we can make use of the of the daylight hours, because they seem to be coming to a close. I feel like it's getting dark. It is tricky to tell. Okay, it's it yeah, and it's raining. Ugh. A little bit more self. I love the rain. I love rain smell. I know that there, I heard that there's a technical word for the smell of rain. But I can't remember what it is. Ooh. Something in the water. Ah, didn't bring a lockpick with me again. Okay, at least we're not going to be wanting for nails for a while. Okay, there's an Omega over there. There's like a, 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 a Gomjubar. Let's try this sickle out. Oh, it, it, okay, it does a dash back. That's pretty good. Slick back. That's what I said. No. Yeah. I'm a man pimp named Slick Back. Ooh, building. The ruin. Ruin has come to my family. Spider!
That's pretty good. It's kicking my ass. Yo! I'm gaming in here. Okay, this thing fucking rocks. Okay, the spiders seem to come in too. And I stepped on... Oh, these aren't healing pills. These aren't healing pills. These aren't healing pills. I got the wrong pills. Run! To the base! Should I use my once per day sprint? Yes. Go! Go! More spiders. They come! They come! Run! And Zooks were smoked. Boy, they. We're done for. Right, I'm one hit. Ants. We're close. We made it. Wait, what the fuck? Who's this? The body of a man wearing a helmet. His head's been severed. Head? No! Someone scratched out the word liar on the helmet's viewfinder. Key to the underground, tunnel number 21. And a weird book. Ew, that's disgusting. That was the, the traitor, that was the guy. Oh. Alright, first of all, we drink from the well. That was the guy! That was our friend! Next, we cook. Oh! <gasps> Yosh! Healing items will be less effective. My accuracy will decrease. <sighs> what's the, okay, the trade-off? I will deal double damage in melee when close to death. My vitality will increase. Once a day, I will be able to come invisible to enemies if I stay still. I want vitality increase. Oh boy, is it time to trip balls? It is. Can I afford... Can I afford lower accuracy? When it's hard enough already? I think we tend to overheal a lot anyway. Oh. Okay. We didn't go on a mushroom trip. Sickle is repaired. I can't upgrade the sickle. Hmm. You never use guns anyway. Yeah, true. I hate one-use items! I can't stand them! They suck. Video games? Because look at how much shit it costs to make them, and it's only one shot. You know? Alright, fuck it. Just for you, I'm making one. But it's for a dire emergencies only, alright? Dire emergencies only. My bear twap is still there. Okay. We've got a key to the underground. Can I go back? Surely not. Man, I feel bad for that guy. No, I can't go back. 
I genuinely feel really bad for that guy. I liked him. He was so helpful. Right, but it's all about the three now, boys. It's all about the three. Curious the trader had a key to the tunnel like yours, though. Yeah, yeah. But a specific tunnel. Like, specifically number 21. Almost night time. Almost night time. We'll see what manner of foul fucking entities try and come and fuck with me this night. Your key was also for 21, just to clarify. Ooh, okay. Yeah, weird. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Let's see if I can make a lockpick. Nope. Bugger. Uh, we need the shells. We need to go squish some bugs. To make some armor. That'd be handy. There's fun lore and implications to piece together behind the scenes. Good. Good, good, good. Alright, it's time. Alright, let's just chill, boys. We're chilling. We're being chilling. Let's try and survive the night. The, the sickle does do a lot of damage. Everyone just relax. Everyone just chillax. I wish we could sleep. I really wish we could just sleep and skip nights, you know? I guess that's not the point of the game. Oh, oh it's just birds. <laughs> Those fucking crows startled me. They're gathering. Uh, what should we do tomorrow? What should we do? What should we do in the morning? What should our task be? We gotta go fuck up that talking tree. Actually, we'll read our journal in the morning. When uh, in the in the in the in the time stop. Someone's creaking around next door. I can suggest investigating south with a scrapyard supported to be. Okay, good, good, good. We'll try that out. Fuck. Who's there? It's it's coming in. Door's about to be broken. Two more hits. Three more hits. Dog coming and fucking up my door. Fuck that. That sucks. That's so annoying. Whoa! What the fuck is that? Kill it? Did I kill it?
Oh my god, I'm getting pecked to death. What the fuck was that? That sucked. Jesus. Whoops, wrong one. Wait, where's my body? Unless I didn't drop anything. Fuck. Okay, let's read a journal. All right, uh, the doctor. I've managed to walk a uh, few good kilometers through the underground tunnels, but further passage is blocked by growing roots. Despite this, I feel that I'm closer to my destination. While in the underground passage, I met a peculiar man. He acted strangely, blabbered about a talking tree which emerged on a path to some house in the village. I need to investigate it. The doctor has escaped, so be it. He would only be a hindrance anyway. I finally got out of the tunnels. The hatch sealed itself shut behind me. I'm now at the swamp in an abandoned hideout. I found an old abandoned journal in the swamp hideout, and I've managed to mark the village with the tree on the map. Thanks to it. <laughs> the old journal also included information about a cottage located near the junkyard. According to the notes, I will be able to find some spare compressor parts there. They might come in handy. I found a broken compressor used to be uh, used to fill up oxygen tanks. I've also found a map with the word HOLES on it. Might be worth checking out. I met a crippled man in the flooded village. He's the last living inhabitant there. He begged me to destroy the talking tree. He claims I first need to get to the cellar located near the tree. That's how I will find its roots, which I will need to burn. According to him, it's the only way to get rid of this abomination. An advice from a blind, deaf old man with no legs is the only lead I have so far. It's not much, but I've grown accustomed to it. I encountered a talking tree. Its monstrous roots block my way back. I saw human figures grown into its bark and branches. One of them tried to tell me something, but the words drowned in the other voices. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. We can see all of our items. We have a couple of keys. Okay. The three... What can we give them? So we might make an X. Well, we need to upgrade the worker. We need three wire. Do they have three wire for us? Can we sell... Hmm. Whoops. Do you want some pills? Excellent. So we can upgrade our workbench. We need... Ah, oh, one more wire. One more wire. Alright. That's our mission. We need to find one more wire today. Alright, here we are. And now we need to save up. Control click. Oh, really? I thought I tried that. <laughs> Obviously, that's what I was trying to do. Okay. Um... Oh, that's rope. Fuck. All right, whatever. We'll keep it. So, I guess... Let's make for the cottage near the junkyard. I hope we don't have to fight many more spiders. Let's go. Those spiders are fucking terrifying. Ah, I was probably just doing it wrong. I was trying to like right click and middle click. <laughs> Maybe the only thing I didn't do was left click. 
Stand down. A bottle, alcohol, bear trap, matchstick. Very nice, thank you. I'll take it. Something big's over there. And I'm not fucking with it. I ain't got time for that. Ain't nobody got time for that. A spider! It's a mushroom man, run! Run! <gasps> loot, loot, loot. Brain never remembers actual inputs, just muscle memory. Yeah. Did we end up checking out this place? Or was it too scary? Too many fucked up noises around here. For my liking. It's a big eye bulb. It's a big bulb. Don't. Mom. Mother. Mother. I think the have kid. Who's the mother? Whoa! Nope, 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 nope. Let me out! Let me out! It's dire. No! 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 Fuck! One more! Jesus. Oh my god. Banshee babies. That shit was fucked up. Bread. Let me eat that fucking bread. Fuck you! <laughs> Get killed, dickhead. Dude, there is so much stuff in here. What's up, eyeball? Alright, we're up, we're up. Holy, that was fucked up. That was scary. All right, we need to find some healing. We got some good stuff, but nothing I can heal with, unfortunately. Keep your eyes out for, oh, you found the junkyard? Just keep your eyes out for, for odd looking mushrooms, okay? Those banshees are so fucked up. I need like a great sword, something I can just cleave through multiple enemies with at once. Because those crows. Something else. I'm at the cottage near the junkyard. See what we can. Oh god. Oh, it's murky. There's a mushroom over there, though. A good main swing from the sickle does just that. All right, good, good, good. All right. Ah! 
<laughs> oh man. Oh, I'm dizzy. I'm dizzy. Bog Satan enters stage left. I think we're dead. I think I'm fucked. Yeah, I'm dead. Jesus Christ, that was like one of those crocodile fellas. At least we got another sickle, hey? Oh no, the rot. The rot is spreading. That fucking rot that ruined our, our old base. Actually, can we take, we're taking the meat, we're taking the meat, because we gotta level up, we gotta level up. Um, drop the bear trap. In fact, you know what? Gas bottle? Control click? No. Control click removes. I want two matches. Fuck it. Give me three matches and three bottles. Drop the shiny stone. Chuck you there, chuck you there. Flashlight can stay. It's called a torch, love. It's called a fucking torch. All right, we gan. Bog Satan. I said it before, and I'll say it again. I love when when a game doesn't tell you what things are called. Um, and I, I I like when you have to come up with names for things yourself. Because I, I I know that the red things are called red chompers, but I just like calling them red things. Mushroom. Is that a cultist? I've got some mushrooms to eat. We, 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 we have healing. We have some healing items. There's a cultist around here. Stamping his fucking feet. There's a hole in the ground with some meat in it. I'm gonna go this way. I don't like the constant, like, rubbing uh, of, like, squeaky cheese noises that's going on. Like, it's really scary. Alright, don't forget we have our roar. We have our once per day roar that we can do. Do the roar. Fuck you, sporter. All right, we're here in the junkyard. What the fuck is that sound? Oh, okay. It's a... Uh... It spits acid! It's chain me! It's I'm tethered! Wampa. Alright, he broke my fucking weapon. E. That better not be a. <laughs> Fuck! There's so many of them. I'm dead, I'm dead. The most aggressive junkyard I've ever seen? Hell yeah, good. I'm not playing no baby games. It's all oily in here. I don't have a shovel. E. There's a lot of... St That's a cultist. 
He will kill me. Okay, we gotta be making note of these things. It looks like those eyeballs emerge in patterns. I just need to find my lost inventory. Thank you. We're running low. That was the doctor? That's not the doctor. That's a cultist. That's for sure a cultist. Alright, well, we'll check him out nonetheless. Now look, he's got spikes. <laughs> Doctor, help! I'm dead. I have no items. I have no weapons. Die, oh, you fucking bitch! Yo. Doctor, give me a fucking gun! Whoa! Dude, look, he's got like a crown of thorns going on. This land hides more of the secrets than your little fucking rat brain is capable of understanding. The doctor digs through the mud. I think he's looking for something. Deep underground, there's a current of electricity. Fucking electricity! He starts flailing his arms wildly. <laughs> throwing pieces of mud around everywhere around him. And it flows underground from tree to tree. The doctor suddenly freezes, staring at me with his arms midair. And it powers everything and connects it all. If I had a light bulb, if I just screwed it into one of these branches, it would light up. I bet it fucking would. He bends over a small hole in the mud and continues digging. Maybe this is where you're hiding. Maybe this is the way. Hmm. This motherfucker kind of kooky. Alright, I'm gonna... <laughs> Fill up my drink. Give me one second. Holy moly. Check on the boys. I have to check on the boys. I bought the boys a um a little puzzle. A little. It's like one of those little uh, bottom heavy uh, things that you put treats in, and they have to kind of like wiggle it around so that the treats fall through a little hole. And they've uh, yeah, they've enjoyed they've enjoyed working with it. It's very cute. All right, give me a oh, dude. Yeah, you got nothing. Nothing. I haven't slept to wink in many days. I don't think this is good for me. I hear this voice all the time. Can you hear it? Her heavenly voice. The doctor stares right into my eyes. Mud drips from his face. He hasn't blinked in over a minute. No, you don't. Why would you? You don't know her. Note in his trade, you have rep with him already? He steps towards me and lowers his voice. I'm a bit fed up with her. A little bit. A tiny little bit. She must know I'm heading her way. I'm doing everything I can. I don't eat. I don't sleep. I search under every rock. Under every fucking bush. She must understand it. She must give me some time. Some little time off. Tell her this, will you? What do I want? Give me the bolt handle. All right. <laughs> All right, well, we have absolutely nothing. I think it's time to find a weapon. Yeah, we got a free bolt handle.
Get caught on the trap. Get caught on the trap. Get caught on the trap. Okay, I got caught on the trap. Get old! You're old! You're gay. Fuck you. The Great Lake? Oh my god, that's so fucking creepy. Yeah, they're scuttling around there. They're doing something. They're up to no good. I just need to find my old inventory. There it is. Ah, I'm dead. I'm dead again. I'm dead again. Hey, come on, man. Come on, man. Hey, fuck you, man. Yeah, fuck you. Get out of here. Okay, that's apparently nothing to worry about, this, this shit here. Ooh, a hole. Oh, fuck off. There's some bullshit in the water. Oh, fuck. Dude. This is so fucked. It's too creepy, man. Someone's placed some white mushrooms around the body. The two largest ones have been carefully inserted into the dead man's eye sockets. Yo, that's kind of fucking awesome. <laughs> that's awesome. <laughs> that's cool as fuck. Not gonna lie. Run! Oh my... Days. This is unbelievable, dude. <sighs> it's, it's a lot of fucking baddies. Oh, the rot is spreading. Fucking rot is spreading. Okay. Tay, give me one match. Oh, that's a nail. I'll to keep the torch. Just want one match. Do I have any healing items that I can take with me? Hmm. No, I do not. What can I make here? Hot bar upgrade? Inventory upgrade? I guess I should make an inventory upgrade. Cool, there we go. Alright, back out we go. Uh, let's prepare the doorway, actually. Uh, is it even worth it? Yes, it is. Because the rot will spread. I don't want the fucking rot to spread. It's so bad. Okay, we're not going back for our stuff tonight, I don't think. Yeah, it's too late. It's too dark. Oop, whoops. My bad. Awesome, awesome. Oh, what? How did that turn into scrap metal? 
All right, two bear traps. Let's make... Uh, see? See, that's the thing with the bloody... Single-use bloody... Weapons. Right, I'm going to put a bear trap here. I'm going to put a bear trap... Here. Actually, okay, let's dump our stuff. I'll keep this. I'll keep... I won't keep that. I won't keep that. I would like one matchstick, please. Two glasses of milk, please. And we're going to fill up the generator a little bit more. There we go. That'll do. Okay. <sighs> so we've got two weapons. Let's make a lockpick. Fuck, I should not have made that lockpick. Because we were keeping those wires to... Um, to upgrade the workbench. Uh, oh well. Oh well. Where did that lockpick sit in the inventory? We've got two of them here. All right, boys, let's just chill. We're just bing chilling. Let's just bing chilling. And then we'll, we'll try a little bit more because, the, ugh, Jesus Christ, playing this game is such a mental drain. It's such a mental effort. Uh, same with, um, Okuto no Ken game. What's that one called? That one's a bit of a mental drain too, because we're <laughs> focusing on those combos. I might play something different tomorrow night, just as something a little bit like less stressful. <sighs> Fuck you. That's pretty good. You wanted to turn your oven on? God, yeah, God hand, that's the one. Yes, yes, yes. Ah, look, uh, uh, I won't. Be, uh, I don't think I'm going to be streaming for much longer. I'll preheat the oven in a bit. So when it says like, do I press Alt or Control? No, Control is my dodge. How do I cycle to the different thing? Who's out there? They can hold when you see the arrow. Oh, of course, of course, of course. Nope. That because clicking searches it. Nope. Nothing. We will never retrieve this item. Never ever. There are some footprints on the floor. That's okay, it's okay. The warp, the void, hello? Steady. I want to. I, I want to live. I want to live. I want to live, live, live. I want to live, live, live. I want to live so I can get some more reputation with the three. Who's out there yucking it up? What? Yeah, they're busting in.
Fucking hell. Someone's still fucking around. Come on. It's not too long till morning. I hear the triumphant... Oh, the triumphant music. Fuck off. Stand back! We made it. 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 Woo! Others. Yeah, baby. <laughs> the three. We gained reputation with the three. Please tell me that reduces the fucking sludge. The encroaching sludge. Alright, all the bodies disappeared, which is a little bit annoying. Wait, that... It did reduce, I think. I think that reduces the fucking slime. The encroaching sludge. Okay, those traps came in really handy. I want to bust through this metal door. The door handle's covered with slam. Alright, let me cook. Oh, ew! The whole house is stinky! That sucks. Okay, at least the kitchen's fine. Let me know if you want some info about how the sludge works. I'll leave you to brain- Oh, my brain doesn't fucking work, dude. Do you have to set the- Do I set the sludge on fire? <laughs> that is my- That is my first and sort of only question, really. The three. What have you got for me, the three? Okay. We got 540 rep. I want an axe blade. But, hang on, let's figure out what we need in order to make an axe. Sludge, no, like fire, yes. Okay. But, yeah, see, I, I, I'm being all tripped and turned around because this kind of sludge doesn't give a shit. You can slap it with a torch or go full ape shit and toss a molotov in there. Well, like, like, hang on, hang on, do you mean this shit? Because I've tried that and it didn't work. Kalido, welcome. What the fuck? That it actually works, dude. Okay, so okay. Last, uh, 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 in the third base, in the first zone, right? In, in, in like, in like the previous area, in, in the, in the dark, deep wood part. Um, uh, my fucking um base around like, like, like the room which had my my crafting bench in it filled up with that like corpse sludge and i threw a, a a molotov in there and it didn't clear it so i kept like suicide running to craft stuff and it made me so mad i can't believe it what the fuck uh. kalito how you doing brother what you been up to been keeping well in playing cool game. Goodness me, I can't believe it. The torch went out. <sighs> it's so bullshit. Ah, <laughs> uh, look, don't worry about it. It's just bad luck, I guess. Sleeping and working. Yeah, brother. That's the way. I don't have any rags. Alright, let's buy a rag off the three. One, one rag, please. One piece of rag, please. 
I'll take two. Thank you. Also to mention, there's a certain event of the night that causes it to appear. I think it's like, I, I, I think it's when you die, but I'm probably totally wrong on that. I feel like when you die, the sludge uh, emerges. Oh, I mean, I can't open that anyway, so. GTA 6 trailer tomorrow? Oh, really? I've actually never played a GTA game. I, I think I played a little bit of San Andreas one time, but uh, yeah, like no, <laughs> I haven't really ever played one. Ah, shit! I gotta make another, gotta make another torch. And I'm burning through them. Guess we have the, we have the flashlight for we have the torch we have the we have the torch torch for light. One more hit. Torch went out. Ah, fuck! Alright, whatever. We'll find more rags. We'll find more rags later. Okay, what do we need? I would like my... I'll take a shiny rock. We can, we can trade. I'll take the flashlight with me just in case. Myers bolt handle, fabric, bandages with alcohol. I'll take for healing. Bottle bear trip. We have two bear traps for the night time. What games are you guys looking forward to? Because like, I, I don't know. I, I, I don't... I don't follow the video game industry scene, really? Alright, I've got the axe head. But yeah, are there any games that are like, on their way that you're like, yo! Oh, we need three wires. Stalker 2 is my main thing, but I'm being cautious with my optimism. Yeah, I need to go back and play more of uh, more Stalker. I, I did really enjoy it when we played it here. Alright, don't make a lockpick. Don't make a lockpick. Don't make a lockpick. In fact, for that reason, we're going to put these two wires here in this corner. I'm going to move everything else over here. Oh, those are Heelys. Alright, I'm going to take the pills for Heelys. I'm going to take this gas tank as well. Okay. Everyone breathe in. Now breathe in again. Now breathe out. Alright, one more day. One more day, boys. One more day. Then I gotta cook. Um, hang on. How do you do? Exclamation mark. S-O at Carl. Carl! What were you playing most last? Dead Island 2! Oh, that's right, I remember. Yeah, I had a lot of fun. A lot of fun. Also, no VOD of the first hideout. Oh, no, no, no. It was, it was, the, it was the third hideout that you encounter in that... Um, the, the map prior to the swamp. Yeah. Maybe it was bad hitboxing. Right, was that a fucking tail? <gasps> fish! Yo, Pog? I caught a fish? Can I eat it? We'll eat it later. I, I remember playing, yeah, Dead Island uh, with the boys in the div back in the day. She was epic. Oh, 
Oh, okay. I mean, that sorted itself out quite nicely, I think. Thank you, Mushroom Man. Hell yeah. <laughs> That's awesome. Let's go. That was, that was really good. I'm happy. <laughs> yeah, all right. Look, got a. I do it. Something's coming. Something's coming. Something else is coming, dude. And it's not one of those guys. I hear some bullshit. There we go. This really is Schizophrenia Simulator. <sighs> There's a hole in my soul. What a head south. We gotta go back to the fucking... To the... To the shitville. Oh, fuck off. You don't want to... Dog, what are you even doing? How is the dog still here? What are you doing, bro? There's mushroom men. There's eldritch bullshit. I guess the dog is big. Huge, in fact. Right, I'm gonna... Actually, no. Our healing is diminished. I will heal now. <sighs> so there's stuff in there that we didn't that we didn't grab. That's such a cool that's a cool mechanic. That's a very cool mechanic. There's a few things that we didn't pick up, like this pill, tape, pliers, board. Alright, there we go, there we go, there we go. Also, Carlito, welcome to the fucking Eldritch Madness, by the way. We've encountered some crazy shit since, uh, you would've, you would've last seen this. It's getting fucked in here. Alright, remember, we have our primal screech. We have our daily primal screech. We're becoming powerful survivors. Where there's one, there's two. Where there's one, there's two. These are the ones from the other day. Alright, keep an eye out. Because there's fucking bound to be more of them. We want to stay out of the water as much as possible. Fuck you! Hey! 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 Get back here, motherfucker! Hoi! Can I rotate this thing? Dude, I want to make this a fucking... Fuck! <laughs> God damn it! I wanted to make it a cool bomb, a cool explosive. Maybe I can throw the fish at him and distract him. No, I can only eat it. Alright. 
In we go. In we go. <sighs> Keep your wits about you. Steal yourself. Right, I've got my mushroom for healing. What's over here? Okay, not doing that voice again. The mushrooms are talk. Oh, dude, this is some Junja Ito shit. I'm here, trapped. I'm here. This is literally the fucking um, Uzumaki snail man. I hear, I hear you. Cut me loose, please. Who are you? Ooh! The Omega Snail! Hello? It's on the building. Fuck off! Location already marked junkyard. A bear trap, many nails and planks, some useful scrap metal, gun parts, uh, rope, tapes, antlers, some tools, scrap metal, and an old compressor at F. We need to go to F. Is that F? Broken axe. Oh, it'll say F on the ground, remember? Organic cord. Some kind of organic cords, they're slowly pulsating. They're surprisingly hard and durable. It wants me to cut them, though. Okay, I'm not allowed to cut them. I'd like to go in here, though. I hope the snail is a friend and not a foe. I still need a shovel to dig though. The shell is cracked. Hand. It looks like a human hand, but it's sticky and grown into the shell. A key grows out of the palm. I should be able to easily tear it off. Shed key. Can I talk to you? Hello. Oh! Oh, that's so fucked up. The snail's speech is extremely slow and slurred. He moves his jaw with great effort. It looks like it's about to fall off. His eyes sag from their sockets. They dangle from side to side, trying to keep me in their sight. Why? Why are you disturbing my forced rest? It's a fucking human skull, dude. Jesus Christ. His right eye raises with great effort and wobbles. Your face! What happened to you? The snail's jaw falls so low it almost detaches itself from the rest of the body. You scared me. You barely resemble a human. You should cover yourself. Suddenly I feel a subtle shiver beneath my feet. The snail's body livens up. Quiet! Hear that? Do hear that voice? The snail tucks his head inside his shell. She calls to me. Can you hear it? The snail falls silent for a longer moment. The inside of the shell is almost completely silent. She's calling me and I'm here, trapped, bound. The snail's body suddenly leans forward. The wooden construction of the cottage creaks under his huge bulk. I barely keep my balance. Cut me loose, please. I need to get out of here. If you release me, I will leave. Come back tomorrow and I won't be here anymore. You can live in my home. You'll like it. You just need to cut me loose. The snail falls silent. His enormous head slowly drops to the shell. 
giant gleaming drops of mucus appear on his slammy skin. You need to understand my predicament. I'm unable to do anything by myself. My legs are numb from lying here. I can't feel my arms at all. I admit, lying in the sun gives me this strange pleasure. But it's time for me to go. Understand, I, I have to. Show item, but over road. You're going there too? Nod. Everyone is going there. It's the road home after all. Once there was a beautiful clearing. Now everything's covered in water, and I've lost my gum boots. Do you have any gum boots on you? It was yesterday, or a few days ago. Maybe a year. I woke up in front of a house. I thought I was dreaming. I took a step and fell down. I fell straight on the roof. How did this happen? You're so ugly. I feel like puking. You barely resemble a human being. Ayo, hey, chat. Feel free to clip that and send that to your best friend. Poggers! <laughs> Alright. I'm gonna call it there for tonight. <laughs> this shit is, uh, actually no, we haven't saved it for 11 seconds! Hang on! Five. How do I save? Manually save. Save the game. Save the game. Please. Please save the game. Where's my save symbol? Where's my little saving icon? Bro, 43 seconds, dude. X. This is cool. I like this. I like this zone. Okay. We're gonna go until I can save. Fuck off. The life save was probably just talking to the snail. It's alt F. Oh, cool, 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 cool. <laughs> These are more people turning... Okay, are, is this like a snail hive mind or are there more people turning into snails? Anyways. It's all right. It's all right. We get, we're out of here. We're gone. We're done. We're, we're, we're out. Thank you for chilling and uh, having a cool time with me tonight. We made some good progress. Uh, Fandango, thank you for your assistance in the, in the, uh, in the hint department, uh, especially for clearing those corpses. Jesus Christ. Um, I want to play something brand new tomorrow. I don't know what it will be, but Jesus Christ, it's going to be something low intensity so make sure to tune in and see what it is good night everybody i'm cooking my